Good morning. Welcome to your 10 a.m. daily weather briefing. We still have some lingering low cloudiness across the region this morning. You can see that continue to erode or dissipate as we move in the afternoon hours and should see a decent amount of sunshine for this afternoon. Taking a look at our current sounding from this morning, a freezing level at 11,700 feet, winds out of the west, southwest, and low levels about 5 to 10 knots, seeing an increase of our winds as we move above 16,000 feet, around 26 knots, 9,000 feet, then staying rather steady around 20 to 30 knots above that and seek a peak wind out of the west-southwest at 25,000 feet at 30 knots. Our surface analysis this morning, we have a weak coastal boundary. That's giving us this low-level cloud cover and fog this morning and kind of lingering it longer than uh, was expected, as well as this area high pressure overhead, so a fairly stagnant weather pattern not allowing for that uh, fog or low-level cloudiness to be moved out of the region uh, easy easily excuse me and uh, we'll continue to see this weather pattern shape up for the next several days the morning fog and then afternoon sun uh, with uh, very mild conditions in the 70s so taking a look at our current satellite imagery across the region you can see we have this band of cloud cover across the peninsula uh, some low level cloud cover across the area with uh, as well as a good amount of cirrus cloudiness across the region too and i see this coastal boundary kind of wash out across the region not really giving us much chances of precipitation, just kind of lingering the low clouds in here longer this morning. So taking a look at the European front model for the next few days, here's Friday, high pressure and control. Saturday, high pressure and control, very nice weather, warm conditions. Sunday, high pressure and control, once again, warm conditions. Uh, we're moving into Monday, high pressure and control, and continued warm conditions. Could see some record high temperatures across the peninsula for any of these days coming up as we'll be seeing temperatures in the lower and mid-70s, especially for Saturday and Sunday. The record high for Monday is a bit warmer. Uh, but uh, Tuesday looks like another warm day, and then Wednesday, cold front moves through with some more unsettled conditions for Thursday and for Friday, possibly. But continue to monitor that situation as is uh, seven days out as of right now. So looking at our risk chart for today, no chance of precipitation or lightning. A high of 72, a low of 52 tonight, seeing those low ceilings this morning as well as overnight tonight. Light winds south 4 to 8 knots this afternoon, becoming variable and less than 5 knots overnight. Taking a look at our 24-hour terminal forecast, going to see a broken deck around 300 feet, possibly lasting till about noon, but should see that low-level cloud cover really start to erode fairly quickly once we move past the 11 o'clock hour this morning. In the afternoon hour should see VFR conditions lasting until about 2200 local when we see that fog build back in with chances of quarter mile visibility. Our tides are currently normal and looking at the weekend, Saturday and Sunday, Saturday morning fog and low clouds, otherwise partly cloudy. We'll have near record high temperatures expected, a high of 71. The record high for Saturday is 72. Saturday night, fog and low clouds likely, a low 51. And for Sunday, morning fog and low clouds, otherwise partly cloudy, near record high temperatures expected once again. A high of 73, the record on Sunday at Wallops is 75. So taking a look at the next seven days, a.m. fog with a p.m. partly cloudy is the same forecast for Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday, as the weather pattern doesn't really change. Looking like we'll have temperatures varying anywhere from about 71 to 74 degrees for those four days. And then for Wednesday and Thursday, uh, Wednesday, we'll have an 80% chance of rainfall. Thursday, 75% chance of rainfall with a very slight chance of a thunderstorm on uh, Wednesday and Thursday as we'll have a cold front moving through. Temperatures well above average continuing for Wednesday and Thursday in the lower to mid-70s as well as the overnight lows should see the lower to mid-40s this time of year. So overnight lows for Wednesday morning and Thursday morning look to be about 20 degrees above average. So very warm weather pattern for this time of year for uh, Wednesday and Thursday, especially with those overnight lows and uh, some unsettled conditions across the region as well. Well, that's going to complete our 10 a.m. weather briefing. I hope everybody has a great weekend. We'll be back on Monday morning at 8.15 and at 10 a.m.